This is the scribed 3D pen. It's pretty cool. You can use it to make 3D creations by using this pen as building up from a base using various kinds of filaments. There's special filament different than 3D printer filament because it's a little different size for these pens. But you can get all kinds of colors, as you can see there. And you can use PLA and ABS. Well, if you, if you plug this guy in, it takes two to three minutes to warm up. And on this little LCD screen here, you can see currently it says PLA. You can also switch it to ABS. I'm using PLA right now, that's what this is. And then once you have this heated up, currently it shows red, it's gonna change color when it's heated. You can adjust the speed that's fed through using various buttons and sliders and it comes out the end. So we're gonna let this heat up. I'm gonna find a base for the plastic to go onto and we'll continue this video once this is warmed up. Our pen is now at an appropriate temperature. Shows 190 right there. This is a good temperature for PLA. Once we're at the appropriate temperature, hold on back up. You can also adjust temperature with this up arrow. See we're adjusting it up and go down with the down arrow. That's for temperature adjustment. These are for feeding the filament in. So once you're at temperature, you put the filament in there, just so it's in a little bit, and you push the forward button and then it draws it in. Hard to see, but you can see this little notch here. It's being pulled in. And then pretty soon it's gonna be at the end. I'll lift this up so you can see it better. And there it goes. Now you can start drawing. You can adjust the feed speed and the feed rate. You can go backwards. And then you build it up. Now we slowed it down. This is using the slider on the side here. You can speed it up and slow it down with that slider. So if I slide it, let's turn this upside down. If I slide it all the way back, it goes really fast. And I slide all the way forward, it goes really slow. More fine detailed jobs. And you push the forward button again to stop it. And you can go to a different location and start there. This is again the slow setting. Stop it. And in this way, you can build up whatever you're creating. You want to have some clippers as well, just to clip off all these stringy ends. And this is hot until it dries, so don't touch it. We've not really created anything of significance with this 3D pen yet, because there's a bit of a learning curve, just to figure out how to just create things. It's, it's, not, it's a different way of creating, so it's hard to wrap your head around at first, but eventually you get there. And we can push this back button to pull the filament back out when we're all done. You could probably just leave it in there. I prefer not to. And now our filament's out. And you wanna clip off that end so it's a nice clean end for feeding in later. And that's the 3D pen. You can create some pretty awesome structures. If you look online, there's some really awesome structures people have created with these. We're still learning, but we hope to do awesome stuff like that too.